Hello and welcome back everyone to the next episode on SAP Build Apps Low-Code, No-Code Development Training. Recently in the May 2025, SAP have changed the complete initial experience in the SAP Build Lobby. Now, when you're trying to create a Build Apps project or a Build Process Automation project, the experience has been enhanced and has been changed. So in this episode, we are going to specifically talk about this change in experience so that you will just tweak and adapt yourself in order to land onto the correct page when you want to develop a proper build apps low code no code application or a build process remember the change is only on the initial experience when you click the create button the experience or the user experience inside the lobby where uh, you actually create the build apps and processes remains absolutely as as earlier it was so let me show you the change what they have done so when you come back to sap build lobby you can now create all kinds of application all from here so if i click on create button you can see we've got application we've got automated process and we got build site this very much resembles with the build portfolio which includes build apps build process automation and build work zone so we start with the build application when we select that we are now going to get a lot of bunch of options the first one is called full stack development the full stack development option is suitable for pro code developers colleagues who have very good coding knowledge so in that when you go you can choose programming languages like abap java and node.js so when i click next button there you can see full stack ABAP based on ABAP and Cloud Wrap framework, Node.js and Java based on CAP Cloud Application Programming Model framework. Once you subscribe to ABAP environment and once you create SAP Build Code subscription, then these options will become enabled automatically. You can see currently not subscribed. When you click, you will see a bit more information on the right side for these corresponding options. We click on previous button and now we see the remaining options so this is the old approach of sap build apps so that is now called front end here so then we have the back end for sap build you know cloud functions and finally we have mobile development kit or so called mdk approach you can join my mdk course on anubautrainings.com if you are interested so since we didn't subscribe mdk service it's currently not subscribed then we choose front end for sap build apps now and i click on next button and here again you see two more options the web and mobile when you click you can see this is your old build apps so this is the option you must choose if you are a citizen developer who would willing to build application using build apps with low code no code environment whereas if you are a pro developer and willing to build new fury user experience then you will opt for the option called sap business application studio for fury application development that's the one you will opt for so we will choose the sap build apps click on next button and now we can provide the application name so i can say new experience so anubo trainings sap build apps and i click on review so there's an additional review screen so you can see this entire flow comes into kind of a flow chart or a floor plan which you can follow through and click on create button and then you can see as always like in the past it launches the sap build code build apps studio where you can start designing your application so that's a small change we see which is done recently by sap when it comes to the the build apps lobby experience so i hope you understood the change what you all have to use in order to access the sap build apps tool to start designing your low code no code application once again thank you so much for joining this episode if you like the work then please like share and subscribe the channel with your colleagues including in the whatsapp group of your team so your colleagues can also take an advantage of this video once again, thank you so much. Anubhav signing out. Till then, happy coding and goodbye.